Hello friends, welcome to Three Timers Law Classes. Friends, we are doing a series on interpretation of statutes. Friend, in this series, we are doing a topic on general principles of interpretation. Friends, in our earlier lectures, we have seen that the general principle was of two types. First, primary principles, which include four type of rules that are letter rule, mischief rule, golden rule, and rule of harmonious construction. Friends, in secondary principles, we have seen that there are three types of principles first is nosidus soci second adjustum generis and third is redendo singula singulus friends among these all we have done all the topics in our previous lectures and if you have not seen that please see them first and then come on to this lecture friend today's topic is among uh, general principle of interpretation the last redendo singula singulus Friends, understanding the terminology, it is a Latin term for by referring each to each when it is used. The rule is applied to resolve problem when a list of words has a modifying phrase at the end. The phrase refers only to last word. Example, fireman, policeman and doctor in a hospital. Here, in a hospital only applies to doctors and not to firemen and policemen. Meaning, the Renendro Singula Singulus principle concerns the use of word distributively, where a complex sentence has more than one subject and more than one object. It may be right construction to render each to each by reading the provision distributively and applying each object to its each uh, appropriate subject. Use of the rule it is a rule of construction used typically in distributing property. Example When a will says, I deceive and beneath all my real and personal property to A, the principle of redendo singular singulus would apply as if it is read, I deceive all my real property and beneath all my personal property to B, since the word deceive is appropriate only to real property and the term beneath is appropriate only to personal property. Another example, the best example of redundant singular singles is quoted from Wharton's law lexicon. If anyone shall draw, if anyone shall draw or load any sword or gun, the word draw is applied to sword only and word load to gun only. The former verb formal noun and the later to later because it is impossible to load a sword or to draw a gun and so of others application of different sets of words to one another. Let's see a case law. It is a case law of Koteshwar Vittal Kamat versus K. Randapa Baliga. Sorry, Baliga. This rule has been applied in the case in the construction of proviso to article 304 of constitution which reads provided that no bill or amendment for the purpose of clause b shall be introduced or moved in legislation of a state without previous sanction of the president it was held that the word introduced applies to bill and moved applies to amendments Thank you friends for watching my lecture. My next lecture will be on internal aids of interpretation. Thank you friends.